Hey guys, so today is Friday the 17th of May. I am 20 weeks and 6 days pregnant. Tomorrow I will be 21 weeks. I'm so excited. I can't believe it's going by so fast. I just feel like I have to get everything ready now. Like That's how I feel. I feel like this pregnancy is so rushed. Um, <clears throat> but I'm on my way to school. I'm running really late. I'm already 45 minutes late to school but it's okay and then i am gonna go shopping i'm gonna go to tj maxx and look for a few things that i need i kind of want to get my hospital bag stuff ready already just because i have run the risk of having preterm labor so i will be doing that today and i will be taking you guys along with me so i will see you guys when we get to tj maxx all right you guys so i ended up not going to tj maxx i did go to target and i did get a few things let me just show you real quick what i got Okay, so my battery's about to die. So I went to Target and I picked up a few things. I picked up my son's bathing suit for the summer and I think he's gonna love it. I got him the Marvel swim trunks. Like, so it's a shirt and then the shorts come with like all the Marvel characters. I think he's really gonna like it. And I got him some bubbles for his bath. He has been dying to take a bath lately, but he doesn't like taking a bath if there's no bubbles. So I bought him some bubbles. I bought my mom some mousse because she needed it. And then I bought myself this shirt because I couldn't pass it up. I really wanted it. So yeah, so here's that. So right now I'm pretty much just going to eat and watch some TV and probably take a nap. I don't know yet. We'll see. I am going to eat. This is what I'm eating. I'm just eating, just eating pollo loco, two legs, rice, and flour tortillas, and I'm watching Grey's Anatomy. So that's pretty much all I'm gonna do today, and then I'm gonna go pick up Connor. If I do anything else exciting, I'll take you guys along with me. I might go to Costco, so we might go there, but I have to charge my battery. So I'll let you guys go for now. It's a video. <laughs> what are you going to eat? Pupusa? <laughs> hey guys, so we are at a Salvadorian restaurant. I used to come here all the time as a little kid. And I was craving tamales, so, you know, my mom brought me here to satisfy my craving. So we're just going to order some food and eat. Say hi. Aww. Yeah, yeah. Hi, hi everybody. <laughs> hi. Hi, So, I'm going to show you the food it cuts. Alright, guys. So, I'm eating a tamal, a, a tamal de puerco and with my cola champán, which is my favorite Salvadorian drink. My mom is having a... Um, Pan con pavo? That looks bomb though. That looks really good. And then Connor's having a pupusa that my mom already shredded <laughs> for him. So this is our food. Talk. Talk, mommy. It's not a baby. My mommy's in a lot of pain. Not yet. My eyebrows are a disaster. It looks so white because the light's on right here, the soft box. But we are on our way to the movie theaters. We're gonna go watch Shazam. I'm pretty tired though. But I need to get out of the house. It's fine. It's fine. All right, you guys. So it's uh, it's Monday right now. I didn't vlog at all yesterday because I was pretty exhausted and I legit just stayed home and ate and laid in bed. But I did watch the series finale of Game of Thrones. So many people are disappointed with how it ended. Oh shit! I'm running to school already. So many people are so disappointed on how it ended. But honestly. I'm okay with how it ended. I'm happy with how it ended. 
I'm not going to say anything because I don't know if you guys have watched it yet or not. Or if you guys don't even watch it. But I don't want to spoil it for anybody. But I was okay with how it ended. <sighs> so then, yeah, I was just kind of stayed home. Today, I'm on my way to school. I have Spanish class and I'm running late again. No, but yeah, so I was happy with how it ended. Um, I actually started watching this new series. Hold on. I started watching this new series on Netflix that um, Sarah recommended to me. Well, she didn't recommend it, but she was talking about it and it sounded really interesting. So I started watching it last night. It's called Dead to Me. It's a Netflix original. And it's actually really freaking good. I actually really like it so far. I mean, Netflix has been killing it with their like new shows that they're coming out with. So I really, I've really been liking it. So if you are looking for like a new show to watch, definitely check that one out. It's freaking finally sunny in Southern California. It was, it's been so gloomy. So the weather has been ugly. I mean, it's not hot, but it's not cold. It's like that perfect in between. So, it's really good. I'm just dying. I'm, like, I'm the type of person who loves the cold. Like, I'd rather... Sorry, I'm going through a tunnel. Well, under a bridge. I'd rather it be cold than hot. But right now with my pregnancy, I've literally been so... I don't know how to explain it, but... Um, I'm just waiting for the summer to come because I want to go swimming. Swimming is a great exercise for pregnancy. And my aunt has a pool and I've been dying to go. I still need to buy a bathing suit though. I still need to do that. And then I got to pack up my stuff this week because we are going to San Francisco on Monday. Next Monday which is Memorial Day. I'm so excited. I haven't gone anywhere in so long. I think the last place I went, the last place I went was Vegas in March. And that was it. And then we want to plan a trip to to Zion National Forest when my cousin comes back from school because he's graduating next week which is why we're going to San Francisco he's graduating so we're gonna go out there and to a ceremony and then maybe in like mid-June beginning of July we want to do a trip to the for the National Forest the Zion which is like, I don't remember how far it is from here. But yeah, that's the plan. And then I gotta start planning my baby shower. And then I have to have my baby shower early, like I had mentioned, because I might, I, there's a high chance of me having preterm labor and it's really bright outside. I don't know if you guys can tell how bright it is. Wow. I'm debating on whether I should pick up Connor after I get out of class or later. I want to film today before he gets home. So I think I'm going to put him after. I just don't know what to film. I don't know. I'm still trying to figure out like a schedule for myself for like uploading, filming, working in Connor. But Alright guys, I'm about to get to school, so I will talk to you guys in a bit. I know these are more like car vlogs, because literally I spend most of my time in cars in the car now, because I'm always driving around. So, yeah, the pregnancy car vlogs. I am 21 weeks and 2 days pregnant. My baby is as big as an eggplant. And he is moving so much now, it's crazy. Like, he wakes me up in the middle of the night kicking. I feel like this pregnancy is going by so quickly. Okay. We shall see. Alright guys, I'll see you guys later. <laughs> <laughs> Alright 
All right, so I just picked up Connor. Um, why is it doing that? <laughs> nope. <sighs> oh, I just picked up Connor. I legit have the worst heartburn ever. It freaking hurts. We're on our way home. How's school? Fun. What did you do? I play my friends. Did you learn anything? Yeah. What did you learn? Got three. What did you have for lunch? What did you have for lunch? A mac and cheese. Mac and cheese? Yeah. All right, so we are on our way home. I'm supposed to film today, but I have a really bad headache and I have really bad heartburn, and it's killing me. So I need to go buy Tums. Well, I have Tums at home, but ugh. it's really painful. Mm. All right, so we will see you guys later. Bye. I want to take a video. I'm doing it. Um, no, no. I'm keeping up. We are soccer stay much work. Oh. I got bone test. I said, yes, I go do that. Bye. you guys I am um, it's been a few days since I vlogged I was in the hospital on Tuesday today's Thursday the 23rd so I was on as in the hospital on Tuesday the 21st I was there for 12 hours I had an asthma flare-up and then they just wanted to make sure everything was okay with the baby so I was there for <laughs> pretty much all day long that's where I spent my that's where I spent my Tuesdays. Where I spent my Tuesday. I feel like... Oh my god, stupid thing. So, I was there Tuesday. And then Wednesday is my school days. And I was literally at a doctor's appointment with my OB in the morning. To just make sure everything was okay with the baby after my hospital visit. And then I went to school. I had some work I needed to get done before I leave for San Francisco. And then I stayed there and I did my homework. I didn't want to vlog it because it was pretty boring. I stayed in the library, did my homework. And I talked to my counselor to get my classes for the fall. You guys, I feel like I'm overdoing it. Because I'm going to be taking five classes in the fall. And I'm going to have a baby. A newborn baby. So I don't know how that's going to work out for me. But I'm trying to finish my classes as fast as I can. And I know I can do it if I just like set like a, a good schedule for myself. My arm freaking hurts. Like I have this. My mom's bed is pretty old right. So she has like this nail that sticks out underneath the bed. And I was looking for my shoes and like, like literally like scraped myself. You know how like those tiny little scrapes hurt the most? That shit hurts. Um, right now I am going to my second doctor's appointment with my primary to see about my asthma. And I'm so out of breath you guys. It's not even funny. Like my back hurts. My legs hurt. I get out of breath so quickly. I'm so tired. Like, I'm so tired of being pregnant already. And I'm only 21 weeks. 21 and 5 days. 21, 21 weeks and 5 days. My belly is huge. I literally look like I'm already 7, 8 months pregnant. He is moving so much more now, though. It's pretty exciting. It's really nice to feel him actually moving. So, that's a good thing. I'm seeing, like, everybody's posts, like, from EDC from last weekend. And it's, like... Damn, like, I wish I was there. 
they just posted like this spot near my house and it's actually really pretty and i kind of want to go check it out with like see okay, you can see that's by my house like, that's like maybe a 15 minute drive from my house there's so much i want to do with connor this summer before the baby gets here because once the baby gets here i know i'm gonna be really really tired and i'm not gonna have energy for anything i mean i don't have energy right now already and i'm don't even have the baby with me i'm exhausted i'm tired i'm so like i feel like no matter how much water i drink i feel so dehydrated all the time and it's like what the hell like and this has become my like favorite water lately but it's expensive and your girl can't afford it but she still buys it so i literally have like half an hour to kill well like 13 minutes I passed out at 11. I didn't wake up till 9 today. I wanted to wake I want to start waking up at 7 every single day till I just start to just start like getting an actual routine with Connor cuz he's going to be starting kindergarten in August and it's not like preschool where like I can take him anytime I want. I literally have to he has to be at school at a certain time. Dude, I love my freaking hair. So I dyed my hair um what was it last sunday this past sunday and it's like super super black and i freaking love it well shelly dyed my hair for me but it's like really really black and i freaking love it but like i have to have my bangs like this because i saw some stains right here that don't go away <sighs> i like the worst luck with stains you guys it's not even funny like <laughs> remember last year for edc like when we were planning on going to edc i got the splat hair dye for the blue one bitch that shit stained my hands my scalp and my hair was barely even blue it was like what the hell it was horrible like they were calling me smurf because it's too shallow all right let's go because it's too cold <laughs> my mom's freezing her butt off <laughs> you're, <amazing. laughs> you're freezing See the ocean? Yeah. Okay, right there. Don't go anywhere else. <laughs> yeah. It's like tilted. Sit down right here. Hey, what are you doing? 
Det är a little bit i know i've been vlogging a long time but i want to, my house is under renovation so it's crazy okay so literally all the walls are gone okay so technically this is the living room oh they shaved off How's it looks like? Oh my god, it looks so weird. That's gross. Okay, oh my god. That is crazy. This looks so freaking weird. So this is all they've done. Holy shit, he has a gun in there. This is a bathroom. The bathroom smells weird. Look at all that, you guys. Oh my god. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Where the fuck did they do with all that stuff that was in there? Okay, I gotta call my mom. So I'll show you guys, like, as the process goes on, like if I'm able to come into the house, and yeah, it looks like it's gonna take a long time. Okay, it's at the end of house. Okay, so this is a little update on the house. Our that's where our shower was. Our toilet's still standing. No, don't go in there. Don't go in. Don't go in. That's this is where our bathtub used to be. Our bathtub is gone. Our sink is gone. Don't go in there, Connor. Come on. Mm. Pretty much, just the kitchen is a huge mess. <laughs> Connor's really sad that the house is like being remodeled. Connor, it's okay. They're gonna fix it. Mm. Mama TV. Mama TV. Mama TV. Okay, your TV's at the Anora's house. So yeah, that's all they've done pretty much is take out the kitchen and everything. I think the guy's gonna start on the wires. Oh, and they took out our floors. So yeah, that's pretty much it right now. We'll see how it goes throughout the days, throughout the process.